Adolescence is a critical phase that impacts the trajectory of a person's whole life. The majority are growing up in communities that visibly offer no hope. The gold model is focusing on supporting education, social behaviour change and job creation. We are focusing on really hard-hit communities and, and dysfunctional schools. We identify influential young people. We give them intensive support and the platform and the tools to actually reach their full social and economic potential and we harness the influence they have over their peers. We've been doing this since 2004 and we've seen tremendous changes in schools and in communities. At the heart of the gold model is that the message giver is the strongest message and we have evidence that this works. I was 14 when I was introduced to the gold program and it has completely changed my life. I have a job, I have dignity, my community as well as my family look up to me. I've saw the big difference because these, these learners, they behave well now, they are example. There is a lot of changes yeah. to SNAZO, like reading books, school books. The world cannot change us, we can change the world. We all know that we were not born leaders, but it is very possible for us to develop leadership in our I was a girl who worked with the workers, a girl who is not responsible, a girl who is not respectful. Now I am very, I'm very responsible and people out there, they respect me. I am a president of my school. Our proposal is to take a proven, evidence-based, tried and tested model and expand it. This three-year project will impact 36 strategically selected communities from four countries as the foundation to upscale into Africa. This project will change the lives of thousands of young people. 60% of this project is about keeping us in school and empowered. Youth in Zimbabwe feel forgotten. If we get funding from the foundation, we can give this generation opportunity and purpose. Even the most negative young person in the most desperate circumstances, when they're given the opportunity and the love and the support, they start to realise their value, they start to fight for others. They're part of a revolution of hope. The hope for Africa lies in how we invest in its most disenfranchised youth. There is no plan B. People changed my life and I hope this message that we're sending out will affect the whole world so we can live in a better tomorrow.